Hello friends, this is Vital. In this video tutorial, we will learn how to install Dapper ORM into your .NET related projects such as ASP.NET or MSC. In, in this, uh, in this uh, tutorial or video, we can, we can see how to install the Dapper ORM into the MSC project. You can install Dapper ORM also in ASP.NET project, but in this example, we will show, I will show you how to install dapper ORM into MSC project so uh, you might be thinking that it is very easy to uh, easy to install from NuGet uh, NuGet package manager but believe me uh, since NuGet package manager is open source so there are uh, lots of similar types of libraries there so new uh, new developers or beginners or even sometimes experienced developers get confused about the which one to be installed such as if you if i search using the dapper then are then there are multiple uh, libraries are found in uh, NuGet package manager because uh, it's since it is a open source and many people are putting their own libraries into the that NuGet package manager so to make uh, clear about it uh, and to make uh, understandable all the beginners as well as uh, uh, some experienced people who don't know about the ORM so I have decided to record this tutorial to show you how to install the dapper ORM. So uh, I have already written uh, one article on it, but uh, let us see what is the dapper ORM. Dapper ORM is open source ORM, ORM which is used to map Microsoft platform based .NET classes to the database as well as it, as well as it also support complex and advanced database related operations means dapper is nothing but the open source ORM like as an entity framework but ORM is a very very powerful easy to use less code and all these things someone explains the dapper as the king of all the ORM so let us start how to install into our project let us see I have I have project this is a MVC project I know I hope you all know how to create the project so this is project I have created uh, in MVC application so how to install a dapper in this project created project so just uh, right click on it in solution explorer right click means mouse right click and now find the option that is manage nuket package manager manage nuket package so click on it it will be open the window since it is a visual studio 2015 uh, the window is completely different into this uh, so let us uh, loading it and uh, it takes some time to loading the loading the, all the libraries and uh, uh, one more thing that uh, while installing the dapper we need the active internet connection otherwise it will not deface the these libraries so uh, so this is the NuGet package manager from where you can install the all the open source uh, libraries into your project so <coughs> let us uh, let us install this is a search box of the NuGet package manager now type into it dapper da don't go dapper.net or dapper or just type dapper da double p e r and click on search or just uh, was letting searching this now see this is a dapper uh, see there, there are lots of similar type of like dapper font uh, you can see dapper.net dapper js dapper.net see this is but we need not to install this one we are going to install this one that is dapper high performance micro ORM so how can we see the details about it you can see here the description is high performance micro ORM supporting to SQL Server, MySQL, SQLite, SQL IC, and Firebird etc. And uh, which one is uh, this? Suppose author is Sam Saffron, Mark Ravel. This is a Saffron, and they, their official GitHub is that is dapper slash dot net slash that is. So this is a this is a dapper that we are going to install so there are lots of version games see 1.0 1.2 1.2 and all these things so latest version is 
let us origin is 1.4 so this is the latest version select the version which version you want to install you can install anyone that is you can install 1.7 or you can install 1 or you can install anyone so uh, it's better to install uh, latest one so this is the latest one and now click on install button if the library is already installed then uh, install install button it will give the update button so library is not installed into this project so it's given the install button so we have selected a, a version and action is install and now click on install so it takes some time to install so let us let us wait while installing and resolving all the uh, <coughs> all the libraries so it will take some time wait now and uh, this package installation time completely depend on your internet connection speed so it will be resolving action to install dapper 1.4.2 it's some some resolving for adding package now it's finished now you can see that successfully installed dapper 1.42.0 to dapper installation that finished so dapper library is successfully installed into our project so how to confirm the dapper is installed or not so how you can see this is the references this uh, expand it and find c this is a dapper so it's a dapper so uh, i hope you all learn how to install dapper and how to choose exact library which we are looking and i hope this tutorial is very useful uh, to follow my more tutorial follow me on uh, c sharp corner as well as my own blog that is uh, compilemode.com so thanks for watching and